while champagne flowed and a royal escort was on hand to launch the region's latest radio station. Heart FM plans to offer its listeners a diet of soft rock music, but rival commercial stations say they'll prove hard to beat. Joanne Rittle reports. Stand by, everybody. We're on air in ten seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Yeah! Hello, I'm Nick Wright, and welcome to Heart FM. Heart FM, a soft rock high tech station, broke onto the airwaves with much celebration today. And there, enjoying the champagne, was Chairman Lady Cobham and Prince Edward's girlfriend, Sophie Rhys Jones. We're aiming at the 25 to 44 age group, slightly le leaning towards female bias. Um, this is a very high spending, baby booming generation. But what people really wanted to know was whether marriage to Prince Edward is on the cards. I thought we were talking about Heart FM. Competition on the Birmingham airwaves will see commercial station Buzz FM lose its license at the end of the year. But nevertheless, Heart FM bosses are confident. We have very deep pockets in terms of our corporate backers, um, a very professional run board. I've got a great team of staff behind me. Uh, we've invested in great equipment, great technology here. Uh, everything that we can possibly do to ensure our success, we've done. Without doubt that uh, more radio stations will increase um, the total listening to commercial radio. And our greatest competition has always been the BBC. And I still see the BBC as our major competition today. But to make sure Heart FM is kept firmly in people's minds, its promoters have shipped a computerised board over from America, which tells passing motorists what tune the station is playing at that moment.